Hello, hello, hello. Long time no see you, bitches. <laughs> We've just had some food. Watched a little bit of YouTube. I did a tiny bit of grind just to make everyone the same level. Sign your trainer card. No. Um, nearly died again. But now we have a level 10 big leaf. I'm going to keep the grinding down to a minimum off camera so you are seeing most of the footage. Just taking some of the boring shit out. Level 6, level 6, level 6 and 10. A little bit concerned because the first gym is going to be flying and everything we own is going to get wrecked by that. Hopefully Pidgey will get Gust to level 9 from Bell Sprout Tower before dying and we'll be able to carry the team. Um, our whoop is pretty strong too. But we are so weak to it, we're, it's going to be risky. Uh, we can catch them here. They've got Ghastly's here, you know. Oh, we can't evolve to uh, Gengar anyway. So? I don't want an under evolved Pokemon, it sucks. Haunter looks cool, but... Yeah, but you still have to catch it if it comes across. I know, I'm just, I just don't want it to happen. See the pillar shaking? People are upstairs. Sprout Towers, but long ago is a place for Pokemon training. Only those who reach the top will receive a wonderful move. I think it's just flash or cut, and it's not that big a deal. TBH. Um, I wouldn't mind a Bell Sprout. Oh, we're gonna have so many grass Pokemon if we get a Bell Sprout. We can trade Bell Sprout for Onyx. Onyx would help us out a lot. Um, I think he doesn't have to be evolved because he ends up faster than Steelix. Like how Scyther doesn't have to be a scissor. Yeah. It is viable. Um, but Onyx could just save the run from just going game over. So it is actually worth getting a Bell Sprout. Um, yeah, let's stick to it. I have a hard rebuttal that all stand strong. Triggered by this layout. In wh which way? Uh, Lewis, I elaborate. Like the, the background not being perfectly smooth and evenly cropped. Like this is very just makeshift. Uh, it's happened. It turned on a bit because it's back up. And let's just carefully uh, tilt that a bit away. Get rid of the Pokemon background and just extend the white bit. Yeah, I don't know. I like it. It would be tidier. It's it's just because it's uh, easy to slap on there. It is a bit messy and busy, but I kind of I don't think it's fine. It's just a background in it. Here with the lethal lounge, we don't listen to the followers. We just <laughs> do whatever the fuck we want. Or we'll change the other one to Pokemon. Mm. What, you mean get rid of the bottom bar? Maybe. I I, I want to keep the overlay as it is though, because uh, I want to I keep every video the same overlay. Yeah. Rather than change it depending on the game. Cheese chips, level 7. I've just got a nine tails on Pokemon Go. Ooh. My first nine tails. I would like to put a border around the actual game window to like separate it from the background, because it is kind of like just cut straight into it. Amy, I died and lost my sword. How the fuck do I get it back? In Stardew? You lost your sword? Do you drop what you're wearing? I've never died. No. I've never died in it. Tommy's so shit. I have no idea. We, we don't know. <laughs> so it's never happened to me? I know. You can buy more from the Hunter's Guild and craft more at the Blacksmith. I can't believe you can eat... <laughs> I mean, I can totally believe being dying is quite easy to die in the mines. <laughs> Shit, son, that's, that's a first. Damn. <clears throat> we are just mincing these bell sprouts. Level 8? Fucking hell. His attack's going strong. I overstayed my welcome. Who? Yeah. 
Tom in the mines. It's hard not to be greedy though, isn't it? I know, you you did that, you passed out and someone robbed me. Bummed you? Is that a homeless <laughs> person, wasn't it? Yeah, he robbed me. Linus, I think his name was. Yeah, it is. He just helps himself, doesn't he? He's like, he talks to you all arsehole like in person, he just <laughs> helps himself to your pockets. And your b-hole. Oh, we really need that on it, you know. I was thinking about it, we really need it. Mm. I fought hard, but I am weak. That's Pidgey getting on. She's chips dancing around the pillar. <laughs> um, let's. Hmm. Let's focus on everyone but Caterpie for now, because this gym is going to be absolutely, utterly pointless to it. Uh, Whoop is really weak, but at least he can do pure damage. <laughs> if he got a free turn, he could fuck a Pidgey up. I'm trying to remember what um, I think the gym leader's called Faulkner. Yeah. The first gym. I'm trying to remember what he has. He has like two Pidgeys and like a surprise one. So I died on level 11 of the mine, and when I woke up, it said I couldn't remember the past 10 levels. 10. Uh... <gasps> really? That's oh, because you have to do it in increments, don't yeah. you? Yeah, you can only save every five, five levels. Yeah, get fucked, son. What do you? Unbelievable. <laughs> uh, let's see, I haven't spoke to, um... I don't remember his fucking name. Jellybean. Jellybean slipped and bumped into you. A little goober. <laughs> My little goober. <laughs> Still haven't seen any Pokemon yet. You stand guard in this town. Express our gratitude. <clears throat> what a fucking boring tower to work in. Everyone has loads of the same Pokemon. That animation was amazing. He just turns around <laughs> to the trainer and looks shocked. He's like, oh! Oh my god! Uh, he will get absolutely annihilated by Fineware. <clears throat> Little chess chaps. <laughs> Sounds good. Wow. Is um, I want to say is Bell Sprout meant to look like anything, or is all three evolutions based on that kind of response? Because they all have like the corruption mouth, don't they? It's just always look like shit to me, <laughs> even since day one. Pidgey requires so low XP to level up, it's crazy. Such an easy one to raise. <clears throat> you raise me up when I am gay on mountain. How has my phone suddenly got 4%? So shit. It's time for an upgrade, Amy. Mm -hmm. Spend your Christmas money. <laughs> I haven't got any. <clears throat> bom, 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 bom. Yeah, let's keep going with the uh, chips chips. Fast becoming the strongest member of our team after slagging off Pidgey and killing one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm eating my words. Yes, we now have Gust, I think. Yes! We are now fucking solid. Although, it is a special attack, which is our worst stat. <laughs> so we are only very good. So we're not fucking solid. No, we're just extremely adequate. Look at the little animation. 
<laughs> ah, Bell Sprout, what a surprise! <laughs> is that fucking Anthony Bloody Roberto? What is good, son? I haven't seen you in a bit. Chizrips. What is going down in Tony Town? What a fucking scholar! Hello, you lovely bastard! Gus should still fucking bells, man. Finally back at work. Ah, sick. Making all that cash money again, are we? <coughs> jelly bean. Chess chips. Go, jelly bean. I keep calling them chess chips now. Chess chips. Even though I'm not trying to say cheese and chips. Chess it's coming as chess chips. Chess chips. Uh, let's get another save. Now we're using actual saves instead of save states. Is that what's causing the bug? Yeah, we are doing a um, gold uh, Pokemon Gold Nuzlocke. Don't know if you're familiar with what a Nuzlocke is. I heard you mention it before yourself. Uh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> beautiful. Cause you are beautiful. <laughs> uh, you must be getting close to a level by now, surely. Jelly bean. We're getting too high up the town. You have to start trying to catch a bell sprout. We need that fucking onyx. X accuracy can be helpful for the gym battle because of the sand attacks that come in. Does that mean you have to catch this one? Yes. Oh, it's right as that. <gasps> no. I didn't want it. <laughs> it's so hard not to get bell sprout on this tower. It's called fucking bell sprout tower. And we get that. It could even it could actually kill jelly beans so easily too. Don't let the rat kill the jelly bean. <laughs> Aunt said you gotta do some Nuzlocke knitting. If you miss one stitch, start over. I am. <laughs> I'm doing some knitting now. But it, but it's Nuzlocke rules. If you miss one little loop, you have to scrap the whole. Is it? It's Mitzi making, isn't it? Fuck that. They're the real rules for real boys. Oh, oh wait, am I accidentally killing it? Not paying attention because I'm a retard. Yeah. Well, we're getting nothing from the tower. Oh. I keep, it's because I keep reading the chat and then I completely forget. I'm, I'm, you know, everyone only plays Pokemon. You're just mashing the A button, aren't you? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> this is such fucking amateur hour. So, can't you now catch a Pokemon? No, because no. I've killed it, haven't I? Oh. <laughs> Tom is loving it. <laughs> no Pokemon from here either, I guess, guys. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Ben! That also means no Onyx. Because oh. we can't get Bellsprout, can we? Fuck! This this run may end in the first gym. Because I was mashing the A button. Well, to be fair, even if I didn't mash the A button, we'd still be stuck in a fucking Rattata anyway. Yeah. Uh, Chaz Chaps or Big Leaf? Chaz or Chaps? Chaz uh, <laughs> No. Yeah, Gus is gonna fuck up this area. My only concern as well is I kind of need to leave, fully heal when all the trainers are done, and then climb the tower all over again for a full health against the boss. It's like a die. Moss. It is a boss. It sounds like you said moss. For, for the moss. For the moss. For the small bits of tufts of plant and foliage. It's for mosses, isn't it? The bell sprout. <laughs> I haven't getting one level with Jelly Bean, he's so slow to level up. He must be close though. Yeah. Hmm. Because those bell sprouts have cut talk to them, which could fuck up chess chips. Chess chops! We have no more casualties on this one. Apart from that rat attack two seconds ago. <laughs> doesn't count. If we don't want it, doesn't count. <gasps> we switched into a crit. Ooh, I could have been jelly bean dead. The crits are so fucking scary in this game. Yeah. 
Yes! Please give me a good move. Nothing. Fantastic. Water gun's still pretty good for a start off anyway. Alright, so let's do... We're going to carry on with Jelly. Uh, I'm not going to switch out actually, fuck it. He's got his level, that'll do for now. Because I could get level 10 with, uh, with Cheesy Boy. Cheesy Boy. Cheesy Boy. You just don't know. That's so much. Fuck yeah. I wonder how XP share works in this game. Is it still the old rules? I feel like it is. Hmm. I think this is a top. Yeah. Oh, fuck. There's so much to go through. Can't use it, but we can sell it. Okay, um, hmm. 14 HP. They do about 1 health, so a crit do 2. That's 7 hits. At minimum. 1, 2, 3, minimum 3 bell sprouts. 2 hits to kill, 1 hit to kill each one, and we are faster. We could get through without taking any damage at all. You gotta do a lot of math. This is why I stay out of Pokemon. Why <laughs> you don't fail Pokemon? <laughs> It's level six. Oh. I'll be alright. <clears throat> Sit forward for a bit and try and actually pay proper attention. That's a lot of XP. Holy shit! This little squirt sure made me hurt. You might want to reconsider your victory title. <laughs> Whose was that? Some sage. Was that actu the actual title? Yeah, yeah. I thought you made that up. No, I wish I did. Oh my god, that's disgusting. It is absolute vile. But I mean, when you're a sage of the Sprout Tower... <laughs> sage? You take on a certain you're a effigy. You're sage of the Sprout Tower? Yeah, Sage Neil. I, th I thought it was mage. No, they're sages. Sage. Then they become elders of the bell of the Belders? <laughs> Belders? <laughs> Dialogue goes dialect turns terrible and even, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, we're still fucking them up. That's another level two. We are getting strong. Big strong. Woo! Yeah. No defense. No special attack. Get good, son. Seven levels to Pidgeotto. Getting all the cash money too. Give me all my money. Do 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 do. Oh, fucking other rivals there. That's hope. I don't know if you fight them or not here. Maybe I am going all the way back. Who wants one? Uh, do you have decaf? Yes. I'll take a decaf off you all day. I should get a decaf. Do you? Definitely. It'll be full of beans. Full of jelly beans. <laughs> Can I get a jelly up in here? No. Chairs and chops. At least the encounter rate's extremely low here. Yeah, we've got through without a single fight. B E A. Beautiful. Oh, it's this fucking glitch again. So it seems to be transitions are causing it. Yeah, we need to figure out for some reason we are getting these horrible graphic glitches. Just save. Yeah, I have to save and reboot. So I can just reset the stream, any uh, not the stream, the emulator anyway. I'll have to figure out what's causing it. We'll have this fixed for the next stream anyway. For now, reset. Reboot the save. I wonder how this looks. Sorry, I had to shit. What did Amy think of my Nuz Nitlock? Um, I'm already crocheting, so that would not be good. Because if I miss one loop and then I'd have to undo all that and that's like three hours work. No. It's not happening. Not happening. There we go, that's a glitch fixed. Uh, we will figure out what's causing that horrible sprite glitch. 
For now, we must hear. <laughs> He's got you there, and that is the point of the Nuzlocke. That's the game, it's meant to be difficult. You get 100% right with no mistakes. You don't do it at all. Fuck off. My work is... Knit me a to scale leading tower of Pisa, Italy. Italy? Italy. I'll knit you a penis warmer and it'll oh. be big enough. <laughs> it won't be big enough. I mean, it'll be too big. <laughs> That's oh, it. Oh, you got me there. Oh, I messed that up. And your dick's too big. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> um, I will show you the names now, Tony. So we've already had one die. We're gonna have a little um, like a cemetery around the border for the next stream. We've lost one Pidgey. What was the Pidgey's name? Ace. Ace. Ace has died. We currently have cheese chips, toast, jelly bean, and big leaf. <laughs> if we can't think of like a personalized name, we're gonna just name them based on what it looks like, as if you've never heard of Pokemon before. Like Lapras could be like swimming turtle man. Shit like that. Loch Ness, nasty monster. <laughs> I wish there was enough characters for that. <laughs> oh my god. That'll be strong. Right, let's climb that tower as quick as we can. I keep smelling Palmer Violets and that reed diffuser. It's, it's just amazing. Getting me nips right on. It's so good. Is this a new oh, area? it's a ghastly now. So we can't have him. Oh. I know. Can one just be called Listrum and he'll live forever? No, that's too much promotion for your channel. <laughs> we'll have no sellouts here, son. I'll tell you what, we'll do it on one condition. When we reach a route. I'll tell you what Pokemon are available there, and if you call the Pokemon that turns up, and it is, is and it is that Pokemon first try, I will call it Listrum just for you. You're so keen to spam your emotes, oh my god. It's just his face like, one, two, three, four, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight. He's done it nine times in one conversation. <laughs> uh, sick of your fucking mug. Now we're getting gas leaks for days. Every single fight. That's so annoying. Got it. Could have done with the ghost Pokemon too. Tom's just said here, I'm so bad at this. I went to put a seed down, but it was a cherry bomb. It exploded and wiped half of my crops. <laughs> oh, Tom. Tom. For anyone who hasn't played Stardew Valley, that's like saying, I went to go and plant some more basil, but I used a grenade. <laughs> Anything in a tree? I exploded everything. Mythbusters? Anyone? Uh, Explain? Um... That's terrible news, man. Does that actually destroy your crops or just like unplant yeah. them and have to regrow them no, again? No, it destroys them, I think. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like crows can just come in and destroy them and stuff as well. For someone so outdoorsy, you're not doing it well, are you? <laughs> he's not a real farmer, leave him alone. Yeah, it destroyed them as well, but he's got the constitution. He may look like a farmer. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> Sage Troy. Level seven, fucking hell. I'm glad I healed. Right, we need to kill we need to clear this before any major fights. BRB dudes. Okay, Tony, we'll see you in a bit, son. And hello to Bloodluster. I'm sure I've seen your name a couple of times, son. If you're there. Hello. Good evening to thou. Did you kill the bell sprout? It got absolutely ripped inside out. I didn't even take damage, son. Oh, it's got a hoot though. Ooh. This changes everything. Uh oh. Um, I can't switch and just have to hope that I do okay. I didn't pay full attention, so I might have been a. Uh, Sun attack is on. Um, flying ants flying works fine. We have stab with it. I think it's so. Hutu generally has really high HP and is quite defensive, but I think the special defense is lower than the physical defense. Yeah. So Gust should do more, but we're better at physical attacks. Oh wow! Oh no! 
Oh no, you're asleep. This may be premature. <sighs> I could switch in Bailey from Poison It and then bring back in before I get because it has Peck and Peck will fuck us up. Yeah. Or just wait it out and use Tackle. Let's try and tackle and hope we wake up soon. This could be absolutely dire for us. I might have an awakening, but I think it's too early to even buy <gasps> them yet. Chase the chips dies. Shit. Oh no, it hasn't got Peck, it's using Tackle. Okay, he's woke up, so we're not going to have to switch to a sleeping Pokemon at least. Oh, Tackle did way Whoa. more. <laughs> That's fine then. Yes! That's, that is a panic well over. Yes! We're so close to Pidgeotto. Oh, fucking hell, loads of stats for that too. Whew. That was fucking scary. Like, genuinely. This really is like a hard mode. I've never played Pokemon, I had to pay so much attention. Oh look, it's another fucking Ghastly, which I really want. Damn! Damn! You showed us what you've got. And it is indeed good. Take this technical machine. Pokemon are not tools of war. He cost himself the elder, but he was no match for me. All I care about is strong Pokemon that win every time. Alright, you heartless clod. Alright, so I see that cheeky item hiding in the corner before I fight the uh, the main man himself. Oh, thank fuck for that. We have an escape route for later. I'm gonna save just for the sake of it. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Spread them. That is not even a challenge for cheese and chips. So fucking strong. Oof. <laughs> oh, excuse me, it's getting late over there. Ugh. Right, I'm gonna start. It's very dangerous. Surely a peck wouldn't be enough to kill a defensive Chikorita. It'll hurt, but I want to get that poison powder in there. It's gonna be high enough level to probably have peck. Yeah, fucking hell, level 10. Yes! Now please survive. Dear God, survive this. Oh. It did fuck all. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna growl once. Um, so what's that? Seven, eight damage. You underestimated Bigly. The most it can do is a crit, which would be 16 damage, and I have 23. So one growl, and then switch out. Yes! Okay, now we send in... A kinda. I'm gonna be dead cheeky here. Because he is weakened. Jelly Bean's going to get some free XP out of this. We're going to split it three ways. Whew. 
Okay, that was nice and free. Cheesy chips goes back in. As long as it's not a crit, we should be absolutely fine. Yeah, that did absolutely fuck all. Now, if you remember right, Tackle did way more. Oof. And it missed as well. Fucking yes. Ah, uh, fuck it. Boom. There's one more to go, though. It's only a fucking bell sprouts. So let's let uh, Jelly Bean have another bit of XP. It's gonna get scary when Pokemon start having moves like Pursuit to attack you and do double damage on Switch. Because when we don't know it has it, we have to find out by taking a huge hit when we're trying to be safe. Cheesy chips, you're back in the game. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da. Still really worried how we're going to do this first gym, Amy. I think we're going to lose at least one Pokemon. I'm thinking of evolving um, Toast into a Metapod first. Just to at least take one hit if we have to switch. Oh, look at this delicate placement. Like a true hero. You should be able to stand up to fork now. And you should be able to make good use of this. It is a technical machine called Flash. Take it with you. Are TMs, are TMs aren't permanent in this game yet, are they? That was from fucking um, X and Y before then. Black and white onwards, I think? So TMs are like one use only, which mm. fucking sucks. Especially if you Pokemon dies. Yeah, then it's gone. Um, is it? It should say on the description. Are they definitely single use here? I don't know. I feel like he just said, and I just spam through him telling us. Do you want to quickly check on Google for me? My phone's Pokemon dead. Heart Gold. RTM single use. Oh, fuck okay. it. It's fine. We really need it for fucking opening a cave anyway. I'm pretty sure Faulkner gives us TM uh, Roost, which means flying Pokemon heal half health, which is obviously going to go straight to fucking cheese and chips. Mm. We'll learn that way. Soon we even get past the gym leader. I should be running, really, shouldn't I? So, without the chance to get an Onyx, and we can't go through any more routes yet, we are stuck with the Pokemon we have for this gym. It may be wisest to just try and fuck everything up with Pidgey. If we can get it to Pidgeotto before going in, we should stand a good chance. But that's six more levels away. I'm genuinely concerned how this is going to play out. We did not pick the best start of it. What? Chikorita? Yeah. Because it can't do anything for this gym. My Chikorita was fine when I played. Huh. 
You're a champion to make. I'm a trainer, but I can give some advice. Believe me. If you believe, then a championship dream can come true. You believe, then listen. The grass type is weak against flying. Keep this in mind. We are fucked. Are you going in? But it's kind of what we have to do. Even Metapod would be useless. I could get this dude up to level 10. Um. Hmm. Let's try the first trainer. We may have to grind Jelly Bean up to level 10 before we get anywhere. Let's see how we fare against the first trainer. Uh, we can avoid the trainers entirely, but we need the experience, and it'll give us a good gauge of how screwed we're going to get. Spiro. Ooh, that's got pack. And it's level 9. Oh, Jelly Bean. Sweet baby bean. Hey, he's quite defensive. At level 10, he could be fucking helpful for this, actually. Damn, this is going to be difficult. Okay, good. Oh, that's a Fury attack, that's why. That's a fucking lot of damage. That's half my health straight away. Okay, that's some attack and defense. And another level, thank fuck for that. I think we should actually grind, you know. Let's do these trainers. Quick attack is going to be fucking helpful, actually. That's stronger than tackle, always goes first, and it's what his focus is. Um, I'm going back to the Pokemon Center in between every fucking trainer. We have to play this so safe. I know it's not very exciting to watch, but that's how we're going to have to do it. Welcome to fucking hard mode, innit? <laughs> innit? Innit? I wonder if we can buy, oh, we can't even buy like battle item, um, you know like X moves, X, oh, I can't speak, X items like oh, X defend, yeah. we've looted at X accuracy but the marts don't sell them yet. <laughs> That's really frustrating as well. Yeah. After this gym leader we can have access to a route that goes on for absolutely ages and it's really good grind. Hundreds of trainers, loads of money, loads of wild Pokemon. We can't do it until we get past this like hardest fucking wall of the game. Hmm. Hmm. You do the same thing, start with Wooper, switch into Pidgey, try not to die, and then it's gonna be a little bit of grind to get a level on each one, and then we'll go for Faulkner. Bird Keeper Rod. And his little bitch Pidgey. Oh shit. It's gonna cause some issues. Yep. Oh, for fuck's sake, I wish we had Keen Eye. That doesn't have Gust yet, so it only has Tackle. I can use Chikorita for this. Because I just had to level one, but it has sand attack, which is very fucking annoying. It makes it very difficult to play. Yes, doesn't matter. Even if we miss, it takes damage every turn anyway. Oh, it's all coming back to me, Amy. 
I used to know so much. You already, you already do, I'm so confused. This is basic level info, this. I do not play it like this. I do not. I do not. I like that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I do it. <laughs> I like that one, so I'm going to keep that one. Uh, okay, so if he's just sound attacking, I'm going to throw Jelly Bean back in and keep resetting our accuracy back to full. Yeah, that does like nothing. Yes, lad! Lock him up! Oh. If he gets the kill, he'll get more XP than half as well. Two thirds. Yes! Critical hit! Get it in here! And no, no, it's still half. Um, his accuracy isn't lowered. But it depends what level it is. 7k cool. Another freebie. He's do the same thing, right? He's getting poison in there. Yes, we're being so lucky with the um, poison powder accuracy. Yeah, Scoob. I'd love to call a Pokemon Scoob. Scoob. Come on, Scoob. What a stalled battle. Oof. Jelly Bean's getting real. <laughs> Come on, Poison, finish the job. Ish, 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 ish. Same drill, back to the Pokemon Center. We are making progress. So I really want to top everyone off by at least a level. And then we find out if we get game over or not. We're so unbalanced now. This guy is useless to the gym. As soon as we finish it, we'll power him straight back up and he'll be a Butterfree. Um, jelly Bean to 10 could be helpful. What's your best defense? Both your defenses and your HP are pretty high. Gust won't kill you and your physical defense is great. We need to get him to 10 ready. He's quite tanky. We could probably teach him Flash as well for accuracy lowering. I'm gonna try it out with him. I'm sure we can learn it. Now let's see if the team persists. No, it's gone. Fuck. 
does not bode well. Um, let's run to... Oh, you know what I'm worried about? There's a route with a level 5 to 6 Pokemon, but there's a chance of Mareep. I don't know, that's okay, because I was worried that'll absolutely like annihilate our team, but we have grass, so we're okay, actually. This is this a new area? No, this is where we got our um, jelly bean from. I don't know. He's gonna find whip, and I'm gonna get shepherd. <laughs> Cheese chips. Ah, oh, quick attack, hell yeah. And he's still, still really still have done gust. Quick as possible for you. I don't think so, you know. I think it's been a, uh, a downhill struggle for Old Harbour. 36, 36. This may take way too long. Because he can't get the kill himself. Oh, he needs 56. So two more. And he'll get level 9. We can't solo anything because we're only getting bell sprouts as well. We should have come here for bloody bell sprout. <laughs> I'm risking it. It's just not worth dying over. Yeah, he hasn't got his sword back just yet. Uh oh. I'm trying to think of like tips to like get money and stuff quite early in the game, like. Are you handing all your artifacts in to the um, to the museum as well? Also, um, I don't know if you're aware of like the worms that spawn in the ground that you use your hoe on around town that randomly spawn. You get like really good shit from that. It's like an animation of three tiny little yeah, you know, it's about it, like pixel thin worms. A lot more prevalent in winter. Yeah, you get fucking loads in winter. That's because you can't grow anything or really do anything else. To make up for the lack of props. Yeah. Can we have anything but bell sprouts? Yeah, another whoopy. Whoopy. Whoopy Goldberg. That we should have called a whooper Goldberg. Ah. <laughs> oh. It's still like jelly bean. I can't even use jelly bean against him because they'll heal each other if he has the same ability type. And let's keep going with cheese chips. That Palma Violet diffuse is the best thing we've ever had. So strong. I've just been able to smell it constantly and normally. Yeah, you can't smell it once you've like put it in your room, can you? Usually the first couple of days are okay. They start to like peter out a bit, but hopefully this will uh, survive a bit longer. We should sell just the uh, the reeds as well as like it should come in like an extra pack because it's the sticks that run out, not the actual infusion. Like, is it? They get oversaturated. Like they turn on the back of the back. I can't even talk tonight. They tell you on the back of the box not to turn them over. Not you end up, to? Yeah, because that way it runs out of like the ability a lot quicker. I didn't know that. I thought you had to turn it over. Oh, Mudshot! Utterly useless against this gym, but an amazing move. Uh, Mudspot is absolutely useless. Yeah. 
What did you learn? Mud, uh, mud shot. It's like quite weak but low is accuracy and it's ground type. Which is a nice mix up. Um, but ground doesn't hit flying Pokemon. So I can't do any damage with it against this gym. But his HP and defense have gone up. Um, how much to the next level? <laughs> Alright, we're going to try the gym. Tempted to get Pidgey like one more level as well. So he's fighting on his own, he'll level up quite quickly because it's one hit for a like 60 XP. Oh, I'm so worried about this, you know. So, so worried. We could evolve Chikorita into Bayleaf. I think it's level 14, not 16. That's four full levels. Now, fuck that. It's going to take hours. All right, let's just fucking try it. I wish I knew what I was up against. I'm sure it's like fucking Spiro Spiro Pidgeotto. It's going to be game over. I fucking know it. Let's see how close Pidgey is to the level. But he's dead close. No, he's not. <laughs> oh, this is going to be absolutely horrific. We don't oh, want no. anyone to die either. No items I can give him, like berries and shit. Okay, let's see if the cheese chips can solo the pot. <laughs> so it'd be nice to at least use the weaker Pokemon to like get rid of the first one. Yeah. At least I might even try and do that, but if I have to switch in, then I lose loads of health. Because he's got poison, no save poison powder for the last Pokemon. Okay, alright, 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 alright. Right. Let's get fucked. I'm Falconer, the Violet City Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. Not this early in the game. With a Mareep, maybe. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. Oh, he's got his anime stance on too. Oh, it's got Gust. Come on, do more than half. Yes! We'll take a little bit of a damage for this one. That's fine. That's, that's instantly dealt with. That's good. Yes. How did you do that? Because Quick Attack is very good with this this particular... Oh, Pidgeotto straight away. He's got two. Oh. Um, okay, we're going to get one chance to poison it. Why only one chance? Because it Isn't has it Gust clear? and it's going to be very. It's level 13, evolved and super effective against Chikorita. He could die in a hit. But I want a chance to. Oh god, if I could growl it. I want to poison it. It's a Gust as well. Fuck, we might be dead in one hit. No. Nope. Yes, we got to poison him. It may even be worth sacrificing Caterpie. I thought you meant Chikorita. No, no, Caterpie, just. Just so we can bring um, cheese chips in without dying. If I switch him in now, he's 100% going to die. But it means cheese chips gets in without taking damage. Okay. I'm sorry, Toast, but unless you survive this, it's goodbye. So we've lost eight. We're, lo we're, we're losing toast. toast. Yeah, definitely Toast. He's dead at one. I'm happy to do that uh, because we don't need two flying Pokemon. Toast, you were not useless. Without you, this would have been game over. It could still easily be it. Uh, I could flash it, but it's going to cost me a lot of health to do so. Tom's got a strong point because wow, he can so. um, to use flash on it for its accuracy. Um, but I need to get at least two or three in before it takes a good effect. But it is poisoned. Ugh. I feel like just quick attacking is probably the best bet. Honestly. Because then I still need enough health to finish off the third Pokemon. It could be another Pidgeotto. Oh, he only has two. I thought he had three. I 
We've got sand attack. I'm gonna risk one. He's got roost. That's okay. But I should have expected that because I said he has the TM before. Okay, nice one, Tom. Um, I'm gonna use that. Oh, he's got keen eye. He can't have his accuracy lowered. Oh, this is gonna go on for a while. Can I? What has tail? But I think. Oh no, no, his health's way too low. Uh, check moves. So we need to send in Jelly Bean, lower his defense, take the gust, and then quick attack will do more. This should be okay. He's spam he's spamming roost, this is good. No no no. We've only lost Caterpie, this is fine. Luckily the AI is spazzing out a bit. The um the poison damage is forcing it to constantly heal. Uh, it's gonna do an attack at some point, but tail whip is gonna help a lot here. And he only gets 10 roosts anyway, so I have 8 more turns to spam Tail Whip. If I get 3 in, I should kill it in one quick attack. But as soon as it gusts, I have to switch Deli Bean out, so I can only Tail Whip until I take damage. There we go, I've taken damage. If it's not a crit, he won't die. Yes, it takes exactly half my health! <laughs> Holy fuck! Now what we need to happen here is that it roosts upon switching in so I don't take damage because we are all almost dead oh fucking hell no we're gonna die maybe no come on Ben kill it can't do anything else lower it's defense any lower than this This is good. Unless the gym leaders... <laughs> Unless the gym leaders have potions already, we have won this because of quick attack. Because it always goes first. Can I just add, just like to point out the bullshit, look at my level and look at his level. He's a Pidgeotto. He's evolved <laughs> before it's even possible. <laughs> that is actual horseshit. <laughs> we are in there, boys. Fucking done. Cheese chips. It was a critical hit just to just to seal the fucking Ooh. deal. Cheese and chips is a hero. Toast, your sacrifice will not be forgotten. We will honor your name on screen as soon as possible. By that I mean when I can be bothered, aka okay, later, sometime tomorrow. Oh, everyone's getting levels for this. What a, what a victory. That was so like dramatic. That couldn't have been any more difficult. <laughs> it looks so funny how in chat Tom's like, yeah, flash it. And he goes, uh-oh. Because <laughs> it clearly doesn't work. I would also like to say, just think how useful Roost is going to be for us. Yeah. We can actually heal, even in a Nuzlocke. Yeah. That's so fucking good. Cheese Chips is going to be the best fucking Pokemon. <laughs> And we were slagging it off. We were slagging it off so hard. Let's go put um, toast in the cemetery. <laughs> and move rock smash. I'm sure that's roost. Try not to kill another Pokemon then, like, in the new area. Because we need a new Pokemon. Well, we can't yet because we've already caught Jelly Bean from the next area. Well, we might be able to go left now. Uh, no, you need the... We haven't got cut yet. Mm. That's in... Um, you get that from Saving Far Fetched from Ilex Forest. Celebi's Little Forest. I suggest Azalea Town. That's where we're going. That is going to definitely warrant a save. What an absolute hero Toast was. We should set up a, um, a background tomorrow. Like, actually put some... Oh, you're working, aren't you? Yeah. After you finished work, dead late. <laughs> now, on your next day off. Um, again, Amelie is always in charge of the graphics design for everything. 
Fructose, the little caterpillar monk. Don't say that, Tom. You just had frown syndrome. <laughs> um, we should set up like a background where we put the actual sprites of the Pokemon that have died with their names over. So eventually the background is just the graveyard with like a colour. That could be really cool. Hello, Big Dong. We've discovered something. The details are, well, I can't really say anything, but we want you to carry that egg. Um, that egg is going to go straight in the PC box because it's an event Pokemon. I don't even want a Togepi and Togetic anyway. I've had them in nearly every fucking game. I'm so happy that went the way it did. I don't know like, how you even come up with this shit. <laughs> how do you mean, like? You like just knew what it was going to attack with. Oh, all the strategies. <laughs> I used to know so much. Why don't you go on that? Like, do the do the Wi-Fi actual battles and championships stuff. they do? The leagues? Because the past few games just haven't like gripped me enough to do all the proper like mm. EV training and stuff. Didn't the last one win with the Smeagol? Yeah, um, he's totally abusable though. For reasons. <laughs> This sketch ability can learn like anything. Right, we're fully healed toast just to put him in nice and strong. His, cor his caucus? His carcass is nice and fresh. <laughs> his caucus. I'm in the wrong PC. I'm so <laughs> fucking tired. Someone's PC. Deposit. Oh, little beautiful toast. So it's been a pleasure. Now you're in the caterpillar in the sky. You're in the clouds. And move. Oh, you don't have to, I keep forgetting you have to release them, they just sit in this graveyard. Yeah. God rest that little soul. He didn't even get one level. Ace, dead, toast, actual hero. He had a really good ability, by the way, shield dust. Oh. Um, I think it prevents status ailments. You would actually been really fucking strong. Well, you can't be strong when you're fucking dead. <laughs> do, 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 do. You're so violent. Let's go get that egg. Let's go all, let's go all the way fucking back to... Wait, they normally put the assistance in the Pokemon sensors? Why don't I read what he said? I think we have to go all the way back to get that egg, then put it in the PC, and then come back again. I shouldn't say that. There's a lot to fucking run to there. Wait, I'm pretty sure he said his like advisor is going to be in Asley Town. So I could be running back for absolutely no reason. He's at the Pokemon in Violet City. Yeah, I just nearly ran back for no reason. Ooh wee! I'm going to go through this. Gammy hand. Can you see how swan it is just where the top of the cut is? Yeah. It's like Frankenstein's thumb. Yeah. I can actually move the joint. Couldn't even do that like yesterday morning, could I? Yeah. I'm so concerned I'd never be able to play video games ever again. Can you imagine? I can't envision such sadness. <laughs> Is anything else important to do in this town? Uh, we need to teach Roos right now. Most important move we'll ever do. <sighs> we got three Pokemon. <laughs> so fucking weak. <laughs> um, we need a new Pokemon for this next area. But I'm pretty sure it all classes as one route. Uh, we can get rid of Tackle because it's literally just a worse version of Quick Attack. We really should do a fat session of Crawl tomorrow. Yeah. I won't commit to it because I do worry that you'll be in work. I'd hate to I'm come back to like. 
Yeah. It's going back so late and then just start streaming and go back to work in the morning. That's kind of shitty for you. Let me just check this building. We do accept freebies. She's the name of the food she really enjoys eating. And the nickname she gets to a Pokemon, I mean. It's going to have an awful name like Sweet Corn. Strawberry. <laughs> Sweet Corn is close. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm so pooped. Sit forward, try and keep myself awake. So here's a new route, but sort of what is in the way until we've been to Violet City. So we ignore the ruins of Elf, there's nothing valuable for us there. You make a good cup of char. I know. <laughs> now we need to keep close eye that this route changes name so we can immediately catch something. Route 32. Have we already been here? Yes, this is where we got Jelly Bean from. Uh, this is a very long route. We get lots of XP from here. But we could do it one more Pokemon to take advantage of this opportunity. But we can't, wait, what? Huh? Some guy wearing glasses was looking for you. In the, oh! He's in the Pokemon of this town? Fuck's sake. Sorry. Hey. Not only paying much attention to the dialogue. There he is. Have egg. Okay, egg. I will walk its steps until my team is full. So I'm 99% sure that's Togepi, and it's so fucking weak until it's Togekiss. Okay. Will do, Sawyer. <laughs> Oh, it's a kimono girl. Me oh my, that egg must be. That egg is truly an important egg. Please do take care of it for me. Who's this dude? One of the kimono girls from one of the later towns. Um, I don't think you have to have the egg, though. It's not like story important. She might have like unique dialogue if you do. Right, let us through, bitch. We did everything you said. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh! We got the Miracle Seed already. So the Miracle Seed, where it's held by the Pokemon, boosts grass power by 10%. So if you think it's your character, it's better at physical Chikorita. attacks. Chikorita. Chikorita. <laughs> you think of Chikorita? Yeah. It's already got good physical attack, boosted by its ability, uh, by its nature. Yeah. Its Razor Leaf is 10% better because it's already a grass Pokemon. And then Miracle Seed adds 10 more percent. So it's going to start Ooh. nuking shit. Yeah. You watch this space, she's going to get killed in the hit by a crit. Pokemon. Big Leaf. Item. Give. Miracle is he Yes! He is now a big strong. He's a right, big so we're gonna have trainers for fucking days. Right, so we've gotta get Jelly Bean up there. What time is it? Half ten. We'll try and finish this recently and I call it a night. You can head to bed whenever you want, like, you don't have to stay in there for this. I think I might, you know. Yeah, that's fine. I'm tired now. I may actually call it myself, to be honest. Get myself fresh for tomorrow. Finish this battle. Oh 
Oh shit, we need to switch now. What a shame, because he's so close to getting the kill. Oof, that was cool. Raise a leaf, just because why not? So level by now. Oh yeah. Supersonic always baffles me when you find like an AI Zubat. It's got zero fucking accuracy and it hits every fucking time. I'm wrong, I like I've got tiny baby Jeremy Beadle hands. Okay, we are going to save here and call it a night, I think. There's a four hour stream, that'll do nicely. We'll continue this tomorrow and mix it up maybe with some other Switch games, maybe. You know, Dark Souls, I haven't played that in a bit. As always, the full LP will be uploaded to the YouTube channel. No one feels like they missed anything for whatever reason. It's always there, it's free. And that we will call it a night. Take care, you lovely bastards. Bye bye.